Today I'm going to talk about what to expect when you join LiveGood. Now, if you're new here, please hit the subscribe button and like this video and share it with your team as well when you get started because I'm going to lay out all the tips on how I hit diamond in 89 days. So the first thing that you need to consider is your level of excitement, okay? I have people that join every single day and and how they act and how they respond to joining Live Good will ultimately dictate their success in Live Good. So what I mean is when someone joins and they have been looking for an opportunity like this for 30 years and they've done network marketing before and they can't stop thinking about Live Good and what they're going to do with it and they can't sleep at night that's a good that's a good sign that they're going to they're going to put a lot into it and and get the most out of it. Then I have people that they don't even talk to me, they don't respond and they go missing, okay? And they're they're probably not going to do much with Live Good. They're just treating it like a lottery ticket. They they might think it's a scam. They might not believe that it's true, but they signed up just to just to see if if it's true or not, you know. Or or they sign up and they respond to your welcome letter by saying, you know, I haven't had uh, success in these things before, but I'll try with Live Good. Anyone who says they're going to try, they're not going to make it because you got to put your whole heart and soul into this. Now, I know that there's different levels of excitement. You do not have to be jumping up and down when you join. You can always increase your belief in the whole industry the network marketing industry. And what I did to increase my belief was I watched um, testimonials of other network marketers that got successful or got ultimate success. They started making a lot of money in network marketing. I watched Eric Worre on YouTube. He, he uh, does a lot of interviews with top earners in the industry. You can go to businessforhome.org and start reading the news in on that website. That's pretty much the network marketing go-to. Uh, and you can go to the top earners section on that website and see that people do make over a hundred thousand, sometimes even a million dollars a month in network marketing with no special degree or education. So to me, network marketing is the last chance to make life-changing income without a degree or any special education. I'm almost 51, and I don't have a lot of retirement, and so network marketing for me is my last chance to really stockpile a lot of money. So it all depends on your level of excitement. Number two, what is the size of your network? What are you willing to do? I mean, a lot of people, they... Uh, when they join network marketing, they don't want to post it on their Facebook. They don't want it to, uh, they don't want to show their friends or family. They're, they're almost embarrassed. Okay. They, they think that this is a little pyramid deal and their friends are going to think it's a scam. Okay. And that's fine. In the beginning, you might need to get a couple belief checks from live good you might have to see other people making good money. You might have to see the track record. You might have to taste the products, um, whatever. You can increase your belief, but ultimately your network is going to have to be sizable. What I did in the beginning, and I'm I'm notorious for not having an email list, okay? I, I know I'm an internet marketer. I should have a huge email list. I should be emailing my leads every day, but I didn't do that. What I did was I emailed, manually emailed people that were in my inbox. People I may have worked with before in the past in network marketing, but I haven't talked to for years. I just manually emailed 10 to 20 people a day in the beginning. I also messaged maybe 100 people on Facebook that I know, but not close but we'd done, other, we'd done other things together. And I was just like, hey, have you seen this yet? You know, 100,000 people have joined in 10 weeks. Watch the video as soon as possible. You got to get in this. Or I thought of you when I, I thought of you when I saw this. You got to watch the video. You just want to pique curiosity. But don't spam people. Don't spam strangers because um, we don't want spammers in LiveGood. And it will just get your Facebook account blocked. 
Um, so there's other ways to do it. And you can learn how to do that on my YouTube channel, looking at my other playlists. But ultimately, if you have a large network, let's say you're very popular on social media, you have 10,000 followers on Facebook and 10,000 followers on Instagram, you know, you could probably start off really fast, but eventually you're going to have to um, keep recruiting until you find three to five leaders. So it all depends on your network. If you join LiveGood and you don't have any friends on Facebook or anywhere and you don't have any money and you don't want to do videos, then you're pretty much SOL. Okay, You might get one or two people uh, eventually, but you can also learn these techniques as you go. Um, so after I texted and emailed and talked to people on Messenger, I um I did live good reviews on YouTube and it took a, a couple months but I eventually showed up in YouTube at the top when people looked for live good reviews they were looking for a review they they listened to me on video video is great for establishing trust people feel people have to feel like they know I can trust you to join you and so I just hammered the videos every day on YouTube um there's other ways to build this business there's there's so many different social media platforms um, that, you know, there's there's no um, there's no lack of prospects out there. Millions of people are looking for a live good for this opportunity that you have. So um, it's all about finding the networks you want to pr promote on. OK, number three is learning skills to grow your business. There's always a right way and a wrong way to post on social media or to do videos. You could do TikTok videos. Um, TikToks and Facebook Reels are awesome because you can do 15-second videos and ultimately go viral. That's what you're looking for. If you go viral, you could get a lot of prospects and sign-ups into your business. So that's something to look into. I could leave a training under this video. Check out the TikTok course. Um, and then the other thing is consistency. I, I do something every single day for live good. I treat it like a job. You know, when I worked in the, when I worked at a job in the restaurant industry, I worked nine to 10 hours a day. I made about a hundred dollars a day working my butt off around heat, around sharp knives. Uh, sometimes I, lots of times I did doubles, you know, working 12 to 14 hour days and I only made a hundred $100, $120 a day busting my butt and I had nothing to show for it. With Live Good, I'm treating it like a business, but I'm I'm being efficient with it. I can do everything I want to do within an hour each day creating videos like this. I just create content, I text my leaders, and I'm done for the day. I'm very efficient with my time. And I am making life-changing income, so it, it obviously works. Um, so you need to learn skills to share your live good opportunity link. That's all you got to do is just get traffic to your live good landing page, your power line. If you can generate up to 10 leads a day, not spamming people and not buying crappy leads anywhere online. That's, that's against company policy. Don't go to Fiverr and buy leads. That doesn't work. It's crap. They're fake. You need to attract people to you. That's the ultimate people that request info those that's called attraction marketing you're attracting prospects to you that's what you want to ultimately learn but um if you're consistent every day your business will eventually grow and finally you need to have tenacity because this is a real business and there's going to be ups and downs just like any other business you're going to you're going to have slow days you're going to have maybe the first couple months you don't do anything that, that was me when I joined network marketing. And all I did was I learned more about network marketing. The more you learn about network marketing, the more you can earn. And I watched about an hour to two hours of training every night from trainers on YouTube. Eric Worre, Ray Higdon, Todd Falcone. I took notes. I started doing my own videos. They sucked in the beginning, but ultimately they became really good. And I started to attract higher quality prospects. 
So if you want to learn, if you want to earn a lot of money, you have to learn network marketing and you got to be consistent and show up every day and don't jump around into other MLM companies like so many people do. Do not become an MLM jumper. It's common to, it's common for inexperienced people and they're never going to make money. You got to stick with live good for years and it will pay off big. So I hope this helps again, like this video, share it around and we'll talk to you soon.